What is this? Gotcha. It's like some Illuminati. Don't no no questions. <laughs> Our friends told us to stop by this place called Eddie's World and apparently it's just a place filled with like candy and all kinds of stuff and you can fill up your gas tank and you can eat some stuff so It is the largest gas station in the state of California Oh shit, the lar largest gas station in the state of California Cool facts man It has the largest display of a ice cream sundae in the state of California. Yeah, apparently in the bathroom you can play games with your pee stream in the boys' bathroom. Yeah, not in the girls' bathroom though. <laughs> sucks. Yeah, well we got like uh, probably something cool too. No, you don't. It sucks in there. Oh man. We finally got a cool know. bathroom thing and you guys don't get to have it. This has the largest display of the, of the name Eddie in the state of California. Wow, we're really hitting all the landmarks here. that in the, the distance. It's the strip. We're not staying on the strip, by the way. We're not staying on the strip, but we are uh, looking at it. Of us getting COVID or something. We're we staying with sure friends. are looking at it, though. We're staying with friends who have been quarantining. Correct. Sorry, I zoomed in way too hard. Okay. okay. We're staying with friends who have been quarantining. So we're very safe and comfortable. So don't worry out there, folks. We're going to be just fine. We're going to be just safe She's and fine. Tonight. Um. Yeah, we're staying with our friends Chad and V. Yeah, I'm so excited. I miss them so much. So Chad and V, they're YouTubers. They have a YouTube channel. Um, they are spies and hackers on their YouTube yeah, channel. Yeah, they're hacker spies okay. and ninjas, pirate spies. Their demographic is eight to thirteen year olds. But yeah. you know, if you got a kid that watches, you gotta go watch. Okay. If you have a kid, they they know who Chad and V is. They probably do. Um, but we used to be neighbors. So. They used to live like right around the corner from us when we lived in our apartment. And so we used to hang out like every weekend and now they've lived in Vegas for two years and we don't get to hang out every weekend. It sucks because they were literally our social life for a while. And yeah. so uh, it's fun they to get the- pulled from us. Yes, yeah, so it's fun to get the band back together. Yeah. Oh shit, it's the famous South Point Hotel. Oh shit. Okay, everyone remembers the South Point Hotel, right? Uh, with the famous two tint uh, paint job. <laughs> Very the iconic. Famous South Point Hotel. That's right, iconic. This is like the kind of hotel like where if you're you're living in the Midwest and you've never seen Vegas and you're trying to get a deal, and yes. you look on the map and you're like, well, it's right next to the street. Well, it looks just like all the other hotels, honey. <laughs> Looks exactly like it got the it's, lights and everything. It's fifty percent cheaper. Let's stay there. What's what's the big deal? I don't got. You don't realize that there's it's like so far from the street. Well, you want to pay just to walk next to the MGM line as you're going to your 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 room. That's a that's an awful lot of money. That's a lot of money. Okay, there it is. The famous McCarran Airport rental car return sign. There it is. The there famous is. David Copperfield sign. Oh yeah. Dude, I saw David Copperfields in Vegas before. I know. He told me every time I come to Vegas. Dude, I saw it one time before. I know. That was so sick. And you made your girlfriend disappear. He made and my girlfriend. I made your girlfriend. <laughs> 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 Good morning, we're all awake and getting ready to go out to brunch. And Chad uh, is bragging that Las Vegas has the best brunch the best in the world. Best brunch in the world, well I said in America, but I said let me prove it, let me pull out my brunch spreadsheet. <laughs> Here I have all the brunches. He's got a brunch spreadsheet. Where I rate the food quality, the ambience, and uh, <laughs> location and everything. Do you guys have a boner? <laughs> Does everyone have a boner? Yeah, we, all, we all do. This, Look at this spreadsheet. Dude. This video right here is going to get so many views, they're going to rewatch it. I'm going to pause on the spreadsheet. <laughs> like, wow, my audience retention spiked right there. Okay, that's <laughs> He's really good at SEO, too, guys. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> no. He's got our spreadsheet for that, yes, I'm sure. I do have one. Hello, good morning. You want to know one of my favorite noises in the whole world? you whining about? Hmm? Kittens eating is probably one of my favorite noises in the whole world. And kittens mewing, huh? What kittens mewing too. Hello? Oh, that's a cool sound too, I guess. Hello. Hello. Wow, cool sound. Thank you. One of your favorites? One of my favorite sounds. 
You win. You win. You got up there in the ranks of kitties eating. Woo! want to give you all an update because I know you're really interested on when I'm ovulating. Um, so I'm ovulating in two days according to my app. So we got to like, we got to just get really hot and heavy all throughout the week this week. We got hot and heavy two days in the red, but we need to get even closer. So um, if you see Steve slacking and not looking like he's hot and horny and ready, you need to let me know because we don't have time to play games. Right, Joe? We don't have time to play games. Okay, the camera's, camera's not fucking around. We don't have time to play games. Right, guys? Right? <laughs> Today, we're gonna make some progress in this motherfucking bathroom. And I know I say that every month, but we are making progress, <laughs> just very slow pace. Um, I'm putting up the towel rack today. This was a lot of like Tetris going on with figuring out where I wanted to place shelves and stuff. And I think I have it figured out. It's mainly like this area that I can't decide if I wanna keep this, which I bought specifically for this color wall, but I don't know if it's like kinda too bulky now or if I want to put um, this decoration there and then have just like a smaller shelf. I don't know, guys, decisions are hard. And once you put holes in the wall, you put holes in the wall and the only way to get rid of the holes in the wall is with spackling and painting again. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't. Look me in the eyeballs. I don't want to do it. So I'm just taking a lot of time figuring out exactly what I want to do so I don't have to put holes in the walls and then regret it. No regrets. I'm gonna go through a period right now where I just get really focused and I can't pay attention to you when I'm in that zone. So I'm just gonna leave this recording and you'll see what happens, I don't know. Um, but I'm not gonna talk to you because I might get really frustrated and you don't want to see me when I'm frustrated. Only Steve gets to see me when I'm frustrated. You get to see me when I'm either <laughs> sad or happy, that's it. I'm gonna see the ta tantrum Nikki. All right, here we go. My life depends on trying to figure a scribble I could let loose Dodging the dribble that they trying to throw my way I think I figured that them figures out to get you Let them pull the strings that trigger what you say Think it's difficult to get out on my brain I wish life weren't in any other way But it's all side roads to nowhere And I can find a map that seemed to mark my place My heart frigid when it's sitting inside that cold air That exists between our lack of shit to say but I always wanna spend my time with you Even when I'm walking, got no change You still sticking here with me Yeah, you still sticking here with me And I just wanted to say thank you Okay, we got a few more options for what we gotta do with this area and this area okay. So I need your help I'm focused on this area No, 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 don't look at my butt, don't look at my butt Can I hold it while we do this? Yes Thank you Okay, what do we do? Okay, actually, I just found out that's not very efficient. That's because I need your hands. Okay, so first, I want to see what this would look like um, if you oh. hold it up. Yeah, I want to see what that would look like. Like right there. Yeah. Imagine staying on the toilet and hitting your fucking head. Why would you lean back that far? You don't lean back all the way. Oh hell no! What the fuck? You lean back on I a lean toilet back seat? Like it's a recliner. Sometimes. What? Yeah, of course. You're crazy. Guys, do that. Guys, have my back in the comments. Every, no, seriously, we do that. You lean back, like, do your head can hit, can it touch that wall? Just chilling. What? Not to all the way to the wall, but yeah, you know, we just chill. Okay, weirdo. I'm Guys done. Like to chill. I'm done with this conversation. Okay. Okay. What is this? Gotcha. It's like some luminosity. Don't no no questions. <laughs> I'm trying to decide with my brain if I want this or not. <laughs> no questions at this time, sir. Okay, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, secondly, can you hold that, keep that thing in your hand and hold it above the towel rack? Okay, but you gotta move out of the way. No shit. Okay. Ooh, that kinda looks cool. Yeah, I kinda like way, that. I like that way better. 
Then whatever you're gonna do. All right, the other thing I was gonna do is if you put those things, those items down. Mm hmm okay, but closer to it so it's hovering over the mini towel because the cupboards are gonna hit it in, if not. No, 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 not that far. Okay. Okay. Ooh, I kind of like that too. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, bring it a little bit lower. Hmm. I like that one personally. This one? The, the whatever the triangle thing. Okay. And then one more thing. Okay. Um, hold these two guys up over the, the those two things, like centered in this wall. Damn, bro, you give yourself like seven options for shit? Yes. Okay, but the but vertical. Oh. Don't be a dummy. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of cool too. Wait, spread them out a little bit more. So one's one edge is over over the mini one, and then one edge is over the other one. Okay. Okay. Now make the left one horizontal. Uh, I kind of like that too. Imagine it was filled with a white poster. Yeah, that's tight. Hmm. So many options. What's your favorite? Uh, this and the triangle one because it's simple. I think the wood's really big. Yeah, the wood is very big, so I'd have to, I have to put a lot of anchors in, yeah. so that's the only thing I'm oh, hesitant well, I'm just about. The look, though. Oh. Thank you. I'm a scrub, but you still love me, you love me. I'm a scrub, but you still love me, you love me. Even though I don't make no money, you've been there when the times get ugly. I'm a scrub, but you still love me, you love me. I'm a scrub, but you still love me, you love me. Even though I don't make no money. You've been there when the times get ugly. I'm broke. Oh wait, shit. It's um the second verse, right? I think it goes. I decided to go with this art piece for now over this towel rack, but I did like the look of the big shelf too. Steve thinks it's too bulky looking, but I think it could look really good. I also think it can make the wall look a lot taller. Um, I'm gonna probably use one of these frames to put like um an art piece here. I don't know. Or I'll put the shelf up. I haven't decided yet. If there's one thing that I could warn bathroom remodelers about, it would be don't fuck with the towel rack. Just don't fuck with it. Leave it alone. It's not worth it. No matter how cool your towel rack is, it's just not worth it. It's not worth taking out the old one. It's not worth installing a new one. It's just not worth it. Not worth it. Um, but I, that being said, I do really like it, so. There's that. A couple of you had uh, suggested putting S-hooks here and um, hanging the towels like a so, like this, you see? Um, which I really, really like the look of, but I only have one towel. I only have mismatched towels right now. Here's where we're at. I'm also gonna find some things for these shelves. Right now I have a candle, <laughs> that's about it. Um, but yeah, it's coming along. Coming along, guys. Oh, but before I go, am I missing something or like aerosol? Let me just hold on. I got this aerosol can of window cleaner instead of the spray bottle kind because um, when we were at the Airbnb, this is all they had and it is so superior to the spray bottle kind. I don't know if I'm missing something. Is this like really horrible for the environment or something? Is there a reason like not everybody is using this because it is like 10 million times better than the spray bottle. Like, look how shiny this got. This got like so shiny, it was covered. Um, the mirrors are shinier. I don't, I don't know. This, I don't know what I'm missing, but um, it's really good. I'm gonna endorse it for now. <laughs> Not sponsored. I even used it to clean these glass uh, sliding doors and it did a phenomenal job. I'm really impressed. High key recommend, unless it's, unless it explodes children's nurseries or something. I don't know, no, no. Then don't use it. Anyway, almost done. So exciting, so exciting, very exciting. I was like, I've been stuck inside this pocket today. day. Empty walls and stress. Got to start smoking this cess. I turn redundant. I'm a con, I'm ignoring myself. Can't stomach her dwelling. She said he telling me 